Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Mr. Abdullah Abu Melha, founder and chief South Precast Factory in Abha, Saudi Arabia. Who is your company, please? My company is one of the uh, Saudi companies was built in the south of Saudi Arabia since 35 years. And it was uh, starting as a small company, then it's growing because uh, of the booming of the, that region during uh, the, the last uh, 30 years. But uh, unfortunately, uh, the, the precast uh, factory is a business which it's need uh, big complexes and big uh, uh, buildings which it's not there except for uh, some government uh, departments uh, like Ministry of Defense or uh, some uh, Ministry of Interior and uh, we participate partly in that uh, projects but not fully and this is why we shift from precast uh, tr old traditional to the modern one and uh, ready mix concrete and built compounds and all these things. So uh, fortunately the booming is coming again in Saudi Arabia after some time of slowdown. The construction boom. Yeah, construction booming, roads, uh, bridges and, and buildings to schools and hospitals and so. So the business is nowadays in a very good uh, health, if I may say. And uh, we are doing our best in uh, this. Behind that, I was uh, participating in built a company of cement to produce the cement itself, uh, which I was one of the members of the boards, which is South, Pre South Cement, uh, South Province Cement Company. It uh, started since 35 years ago, and it's now became three factories, not one wide factory. So it's a really a very good business and it's covered the region of uh, Jizan and Najran and, uh, and Asir. So I was, uh, this is my uh, part of my history in the business. Are you also exporting to other companies? We are exporting cement from our company to our uh, neighborhood in Yemen during our uh, slowdown of business. But now in Saudi Arabia we are exporting because the local product is not enough for the market. So we are now uh, uh, exporting uh, uh, material of cement, what they call it clinker. Clinker is the, 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 the material uh, before it became cement. They grinded to become a cement with iron. So uh, because of the too much booming in the country, I think the cement companies are not able to fulfill the requirement of the market. The, uh, Saudi Arabia is concerned about creating jobs for the young people. Uh, many people are, uh, yeah, yeah, the, mo the majority of the Saudi population is young, younger than 30 years old. How can construction company serve uh, Saudi youth? The construction company serve uh, this, uh, this uh, young generation by first of all in the companies and big companies they have uh, uh, built an institute like cement company they built an institute and they train the, the uh, unskilled people to be skilled people for this manufacturing Mashallah. and there are uh, a lot of the local uh, uh, young people uh, get this chance and they're working now and they became managers some of them since the way the company was started and behind that we are trying to help and uh, give a loan or give an advice how to to build a small companies for subcontractors to be a subcontractor for building contracting or for ready mix concrete or all these things my last question is, uh, Mr. Abdullah, what is your message as an experienced businessman who went through the ups and downs, as you said? What is your message to Saudi young people? How should you succeed? How can you succeed in life? Saudi young people, uh, including my sons, <laughs> they need to be um, uh, patient. Uh, any young can't be a big in one bend between day and night. You should start small. You should start with a small employee 
then by experience, by training, he will be graduated up till he became an owner of a company. But he can't be immediately from a student to be an owner of a big company or to be a manager of a big company. So this is the end. Then don't hesitate to work anything because anything you learn, it's a benefit for you. It will increase your experience, it will increase your uh, benefit. So try to, to work and to do whatever you can do. Uh, don't be lazy, don't be hesitating, don't be ashamed of anything to do. Mr. Abdullah, thank you so much for this valuable piece of advice for the finish of this interview and thank you very much and all the best for you. Thank and you very much. Shukran. Thank you.